Here are the top natural remedies for polyonal cysts. Polyonal cysts cause you nothing but inconvenience. At first, you might not notice any of the noticeable symptoms except a dimple-like depression in your tailbone. But when it becomes infected, you can suffer from the pains. Some of the causes of polyonal cysts are from loose hairs that penetrate the skin, friction and pressure, skin rubbing against the skin, tight clothing, bicycling, long periods of sitting, family history, your family could be prone to it, and you also could be prone to it from being overweight. Some of the symptoms of polyonal cysts are pain in the tailbone area, redness, swelling, pus, blood draining from the abscess, foul smell, and in some cases the infection spreads and walking and sitting can be very painful. Now let's go to the part you've all been waiting for. Different ways you can actually get rid of your polyonal cyst naturally without having to go for surgery. Remedy number one, apply garlic. Garlic deserves to be on top of the list when it comes to natural healing of polyonal cysts because it's a powerhouse of antibiotics and antifungal properties. When consumed internally, garlic is a powerhouse immunity booster, assisting our body in fighting infection and encouraging the healing process. How to apply. Crush one or two cloves of garlic into a fine paste and apply directly to the infected area. Cover it with a bandage for a few minutes before rinsing it thoroughly with water. You can repeat this remedy for a few days. Add two or three cloves of garlic to your daily diet to improve your immune system. Remedy number two, rub the area with tea tree oil. Certain essential oils for polyonal cysts work great. For example, tea tree oil is a great essential oil for polyonal cysts. It's packed with antifungal, antioxidant, and antibacterial properties. Tea tree oil is proved to be able to shrink down the cysts and reduce inflammation. How to apply. The simplest way is to use a dropper to directly apply the tea tree oil to the cysts or you can dilute the tea tree oil with water, then use a cotton ball to keep it pressed on the cysts for 10 minutes before rinsing it and drying it. It's safe to repeat this action three to four times a day. Use Epsom salt. Epsom salt is another yet simple effective remedy to treat polyonal cysts. Salt helps draw out the toxins or liquid from the cysts and shrink it down considerably. Add an Epsom salt to your bathtub and relaxing for 15 minutes can really reduce the pain and avoid further irritation and inflammation caused by the polyonal cysts. Use black tea bags. Black tea bags with its acidic properties is a natural healer of polyonal cysts, keeping the infection at bay. Its anti-inflammatory nature is also a good source of pain and swelling relief. How to use. Dip a black tea bag in hot water for a few minutes. Then squeeze the excess water from the tea bag and hold it over the infected area for 10 minutes. You can do this several times a day. Turmeric. Turmeric is known for one powerful compound, curcumin, which is extremely effective in healing and infection prevention. Besides antibiotics and anti-inflammatory properties found abundantly in turmeric, also, it provides relief of pain, and also it can drain out the extra liquid from the cysts. How to apply. Add a few drops of water to two teaspoons of turmeric powder to make a fine paste. Then smear the paste to the infected area and rinse it with warm water after the pus dries out. Another natural remedy, aloe. Many people have been counting on aloe vera to cure skin-related conditions thanks to its anti-inflammatory and antibacterial agents. So no wonder aloe vera is trusted to assist in natural healing process and in infection avoidance of polyonal cysts. How to apply. The first method is directly to rub the fresh aloe vera into the infected area. Leave it on for 5 or 10 minutes before washing it with warm water. Another option is to use a cotton ball soaked with aloe vera gel. Cover the infected area with that as well. 
You'll also leave it on for five or 10 minutes and then rinse it with lukewarm water. It's safe to use aloe vera several times a day. Another natural remedy, apple cider vinegar. This amazing multifunctional liquid is the next best thing to natural healing of polyneal cysts. Being an acidin by nature means that apple cider vinegar is able to balance the pH level of their skin. It kills bacteria and effectively removes toxins from the cysts. How to use. You can dip a cotton ball in apple cider vinegar and keep it on the cysts for about five to 10 minutes. Or you could wash the affected area with apple cider vinegar twice a day. Remember, while you're getting rid of your polyneal cysts, make sure you remember to eat a healthy diet. What you eat makes an impact on your healing process. Polyneal cysts are likely to spread when your immune system is weak. So eating healthy foods will strengthen your immune system. Eat things such as vegetables, fruits that are rich in vitamin A and C, nuts, yogurt, garlic, and ginger. I encourage you to share this video with your friends and family to ensure that no one ever has to suffer alone as a result of this skin ailment. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like our video. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment box and I'll answer them. Thanks so much for listening and I hope to see you soon.